Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Vlog number 224. And today is Taiwan Day 8. It's Christmas Day. Merry Christmas. If you haven't already received a Merry Christmas from someone, I'll be the first one. I'll be spending Christmas here, as I said before. Today we're going to go to a place called Tainan, which is just outside of Kaohsiung, just for a day trip. Apparently they have a lot of food there. Um, I think it's more like a cultural place, whereas Kaohsiung is more like a commercial place. Time for some noodles. Yeah, that was a terrible accent. So this is famous winter melon tea because I'm so impressed. be a drum village and you know me I play drums so I had to go here hopefully it's as good as the internet says there's a lot of things to do look at that oh you get you get to play you get to play the thing They're doing our music as well, and they sound even worse. Well, this place used to be an old factory, and they've converted it into a place for making sugar and drums. Look at that. This is a big theater. This is so weird. They have like a garden and all this sugar and this random gardens and a train and this rock climbing. What? Why is there a playground in the middle of nowhere? It's definitely a must see. It's just really weird and a little bit long winded. But the performance is good. Bye bye. supposed to be a night market but there aren't many tourists here. Time is five o'clock. This is supposed to be a famous kind of fried chicken that I've never seen before. I've got a bottle of Alishanti. This is a little bit more classy than normal tea. Oh, back at the hotel. That was a long trip. All right, welcome back to the hotel room. And then we went to uh, Tainan, which is ages. 
And now I think we're going to go back to Rufang Night Market, which is the one that we went to last night. It's so good. It's like the best market we've ever been to. So I think it's worth a second visit for our second last day. And yes, today is Christmas. It's not very Christmassy in Taiwan because uh, this is not a very westernized area of Taiwan. So there's not many Christmas decorations. But I have heard a few Christmas songs on the radio. And that's about it. <laughs> back here again. Probably gonna get run over. Night. Poor Apple Store ever. Oh, I got it again. Yeah, he's, it's, it's that good. dollars well spent. Oh, I want some more. It's past 11 and every single stall is still open. Isn't this insane? I'm gonna get papaya milk because apparently this is a really special. Papaya milk! Ah, oh, these markets are the best. If you're over in Kaohsiung, come to Guifeng Night Markets. Oh. Right, I'm back in the hotel room and I am so tired but basically I'm really sad that I won't be going to a night market in Taiwan anymore. Remember this is our third last day and that night market is one of the best night markets in Taiwan if not the best night market in Taiwan. There's just so much action and that pork knuckle is just so good. It is just ridiculous and it's only four dollars like the equivalent of four Australian dollars which is uh, 100 Taiwanese dollars. Anyway, I hope you had a really good Christmas and a really good Boxing Day and New Year is coming up as well really soon. I'll be spending my New Year's Eve on a plane back to Perth, which is really hilarious because I always happen to miss New Year's Eve somehow. If you look around in Taiwan, there isn't much of a Christmas celebration anyway, so I'm not really that fast. But I hope you had a great Christmas because you deserve it. Anyway, I'm going to go to sleep now once I've finished uploading this video so thank you very much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow for our second last day in Taiwan. Good night!